Hey guys, thanks for clicking in. Today, I got a question for you. How do you pick out a really good wooden bat? Because it seems that there's more and more wood bat tournaments that are popping up. And as a pitcher that played professionally in the National League, the only thing I really know about a bat is how to do this, right? How to bunt. So here's a question I pose out to you. There are really two types of bats that you can take a look at. And this is what a lot of pro ball players did. Look at the difference in the grain size. This bat right here was Greg Lazinski's. It's a nine grain bat. This bat down here is Ken Griffey. These are the ones that you usually see where the grains are real tight. Is it a myth or a fallacy that the bat on the top is a stronger bat because it has more dense wood than all the grains down here on the bottom? You know, when I played ball, uh, there was a couple other things. David Segui used to take a, used to take two bats together and rub them together, or he used to get a big ham bone. And while he was in between innings, he would take that ham bone and rub down on the bat. Nothing illegal about that, but he was just trying to make that surface harder. So there's a lot of myths and fallacies out there. I want to know what you guys think. What really makes a good bat? Is it the grains? Is it rubbing down the bat? Does any of that really help? I wonder if there's been any studies on that. But I've heard both sides, guys. Let's hear from the experts, which is you guys. By the way, speaking of bats, we got a really good hitting tournament, uh, a hitting clinic coming up. Uh, if you let, check below the flyer, this is all the information. I got Donald Wright that was with the Kansas City uh, Royals organization. Is going to come in down the Lindsay Lines, teach some of the best uh, hitting techniques that he teaches his kids. Remember guys, it truly does take a village. That's why I like talking to a lot of coaches, because I like to hear different philosophies. Just another bullet to put on the rung when you're a coach trying to learn and teach, and even as a player trying to get better every day so that you can be better tomorrow than you are today. So guys, check out this camp below. Love to have you out there. It's going to be a fun time from 9 to 1 o'clock. Video analysis, lots of good stuff. Nuke out.